Hey guys, in this video I want to do a speed and camera comparison between my Galaxy S6 versus this small Sony Xperia Z5 compact phone that has um, the same internals as the uh, original Xperia Z5, also has the same type of uh, camera on the back and also um, it's running the Lollipop. So yeah, let's just quickly proceed towards this test here. It's a really bright Sony display. Okay, Galaxy S6 is the winner. You can see I can even start to use it z5 compact took a lot of time there so i'm just going to close everything in the background so yeah s6 winner of the round one let's just quickly hit the benchmarks i got geekbench 3 here on both phones so here we go run benchmark and we'll be back when they're done okay so both phones are done and galaxy s6 just absolutely murdered xperia z5 compact in the multi-core 4661 versus 3983 uh you know the scores on my s6 kind of fluctuates sometimes it's it's uh it's really close to 5000 for some people it's above 5000 but for me in this video it's 4661 which is better than the 3983 on the z5 compact uh which is by the way also low because most of the time i do get 4000 above score uh then also single core score is a lot more similar here so let's see if this will going to affect the real life performance or not so let's just start off doing some apps opening tests here so um I got this uh, some default application to test dog with phone dialer uh, messaging. Uh, let's try out a game here, Temple Run. Okay, so Galaxy S6 wins this pretty easily. Clean win there. Um, let's see what else we have. Subway Surfer, here we go. And again, Galaxy S6 wins the race. Let's try out some apps. We got Wiber. One, two, three, go. Wow, that was pretty equal there. Let's see. Settings. S6 again. Twitter. Again, Galaxy S6 wins. Twitch. Again, S6 wins. So you can see most of the time, Galaxy S6 is faster. Uh, Z5 Compact has all the good stuff to be faster, but I think it's not nicely optimized by Sony itself. So maybe with the Marshmallow update, they will fix this um, slowness. So let's see if we can check out some lost applications. And yeah, we do have WhatsApp on both phones. Here you can see that we got slight difference in that one also. Um, Instagram, one, two, three, go. And again, Galaxy S6, whoa, beats and wins pretty easily. Clear win there. So yeah, Galaxy S6 proved that benchmarks are true it does perform better in real life also so let's see uh if we can check out the camera side by side you can see huge huge slowness there with z5 compact again um so if we can try out another test here uh which is going to be related to the internet and browser so i got chrome on my s6 Yes, of course. I'm gonna test out Google Chrome. And before doing that, I'm gonna just clean up the history and all that stuff so that we have clear, uh, you know, equal showdown 
So let's restart this, and I'm going to do the same thing on my Z5 Compact. So let's go here into settings, then privacy, clear browsing data. I'm going to clear everything, and we're just going to load this again. Here we go, all set good. Both phones are connected to same Wi-Fi connection here. Let's see. No, they are not. And now they are connected to same Wi-Fi connection. Let's see, it's taking some time. Z5 Compact. And yeah, now it's connected to the same Wi-Fi connection. So, first off, we're going to load uh, WWE.com. WWE.com. Let's go. Let's see here. Wow. I think both were equal, maybe. You know, Essex did show the website first, but, you know, they loaded it at the same time. So let's just proceed to another website, which is going to be Phone Arena dot com oops phone arena dot com so um i'm gonna just gonna hit go here we go let's see spirit z5 compact wins this one you can see we can zoom in and out like this no lag whatsoever let's try out Another website. Let's see Apple.com maybe. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's so small. I have you know problems typing. Apple. Whoa! I can't do this. Okay. Let me try it again. Apple. Dot. Com. That's nice. And then we're gonna do the same thing here with our Galaxy S6 with this big keyboard. Let's just hit go. And Samsung Galaxy S6 wins. Yeah, so uh, here you can see that uh, differences are in the in the favor of the S6. S6 is the winner. But uh, there's like really small differences, not like big, big difference. So uh, let's just proceed towards camera. Now, uh, let's just talk about a little bit about the camera first. So uh, tech specs, this is 16 megapixel camera with LED flash. This is 23 megapixel camera with LED flash. This is hybrid autofocus, fastest autofocus on a mobile device. And then also this one has uh, Ability to record videos up to 4K. Uh, Galaxy S6 can also record up to 4K. Um, both have their front camera up to 5 megapixel. And I do enjoy the quality of the Z5 Compact more than the Galaxy S6 because the S6 just makes everything artificial. You know, their beauty shit. I just hate it. While Z5 Compact, on the other hand, just makes the picture a little bit more natural. So uh, let's just take a look here. Some of the side-by-side -side samples and compare them. Now, both phones can perform really nice when it comes to the low-light uh, outdoor situation. So the difference will be in low-light situations. So let's just see here. Okay, so let's take a look at some of the sample shots there side by side now you can see that on the galaxy s6 pick uh, this pick looks a little bit more bright whitish well here you can see that colors are a little bit accurate this brown part and then this uh, inner white part is full white and also you can see if we take a look at the background you can see Galaxy S6 tried to make a pick more brighter, but I think color reproduction in low light is better with this pick here with the Sony phone. So let's see here. This one, this is the keyboard. Now on the Galaxy S6, you can see that the light is just going out and all that. Uh, you can still read all the buttons on the keyboard, but it's just light is just going out. While with the Z5 Compact, it's a, it's a little different result. It's a little bit different result. The light is not just going out, and you know, 
uh, spreading all, uh, all over the place. It's not. It's just inside the buttons, side by side, side in, in inside of the buttons. You can see in the spaces, and you know, and the buttons are black now. Yeah, I don't know why, but <laughs> Galaxy S6 just spread it all the the light here, and uh, so this pic also looks this pic also looks a little bit better on uh, Z5. So let's see here. This one now you can see if we check out the short color. Uh, like I said, both phones produce great results, but the difference will be in uh, terms of um, color reproduction. So you can see that the white color looks a little bit more uh, off white here with the S6, and this one produces a little bit more, uh, n you know, just more whitish, not off white. So uh, overall, this is great. Looks a little bit more bright on the Galaxy S6 because we get a nice control on exposure when we focus. Uh, this pick is also an example of uh, how things can uh, go, uh, be good on Z5 Compact with its new camera, how they have improved their uh, color reproduction. So if I uh, zoom in like this, and you can see that it's all bright. It's, all, it's also looking good here, but it's not as good on uh, like uh, it is on the Z5 Compact. Things are more, a lot more defined, the, especially these colors there. It's more yellowish, and on the top part, it's now green here. So, yeah, I think in low light situations, uh, the Z5 Compact will perform a little more better. But overall, both phones are great uh, to take pictures, and both can perform nice. So, yeah, that was just a full comparison of speed and camera between these two awesome phones. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. Please subscribe, and peace out.